Hi! In this video, I'll go over using the inverse normal function to do an inverse normal problem. The times for a race are normally distributed with a mean of 30 minutes and standard deviation of 3 minutes. What is the cutoff time for the fastest 1% of the racers? Since a value of the variable is requested, we use the inverse normal. The general form for this function needs to know three things. The total area to the left of the unknown value under the bell curve, the mean, and the standard deviation. So if I draw a picture of this just to give us a better idea. Bell curve with a mean of 30. Somewhere down here is a cutoff point for the fastest 1% because they're taking less than the average amount of time. They're taking unusually small amount of time. They're fast. So we use inverse norm. The area to the left of the unknown value is 0.01. The mean is 30 and the standard deviation is 3. So on the calculator we'll go second distributions inverse norm, area to the left of the unknown value is 0 0.01, comma, the mean is 30, comma, the standard deviation is 3. Close parenthesis, enter. So it looks like x is about 23 minutes. for the cutoff for the 1% fastest runners. Okay, let's see if this looks any different when the stat wizards are turned on. And for those who have math print in their calculators turned on. So again, we'll go second, distributions, inverse norm, and so we're prompted. Area means the area to the left of the unknown value, always. 0 0.01, down arrow. The mean, that's mu, that's the Greek letter mu, that stands for the mean, that's 30. And there's little sigma, that's the standard deviation, that's 3. Go to paste. And there's our answer after hitting enter, about 23 minutes. This concludes this video. Hope it's been helpful.